my name is Talaya Cooper. Today is Wednesday, October 10th. I will now begin my week six lab video. Okay, so for starters, I have my hands washed in warm, um, clean water, and I have um, my workstation bleached down with the 10% bleach solution, so everything is clean and ready to go. I have two pipelets here um, being soaked in alcohol, and I have my active cultures here, and I have the... Um, Nutrition, Nutrition Spots, um, 1% NiQ, and the rest of them all labeled three with S. epidermis and three with S. cerevisia. Okay, so for starters, I'm going to take a pipelet. Um, actually, I'm going to start with the active culture. I'm going to take S. epidermis, the active culture. I'm going to flame this by the lid to sterilize it going around in a circular motion. Okay, now that that's done, I'm going to take the um, Nutrition Box S Epidermis 1% NICU, and I'm gonna take that, and I'm gonna sterilize the top of it Okay, now that they are both sterilized, I'm going to take my pipelet out of the alcohol, make sure all the alcohol is removed. I'm going to gather some of the active culture. Okay, now that I have the active culture, I'm going to drop two drops of the active culture into this. One, two, okay. Now I'm going to sterilize the rim. Before I close it. Now I'm going to take the 15%. Uh, no, actually I should do the 7% first. I'm going to take the 7% as epidermis and I am going to sterilize that rim. I'm going to just take it and go in a circular motion to make sure all of it is sterilized. I'm going to take two drops and add it into here of the active culture. One, two. Now we're going to sterilize the rim prior to closing it. Now I'm going to move on to the 15% um, S. epidermis. Okay, I'm going to take it. I'm going to sterilize the rim here. I'm going to add in two more drops of the active culture. One, two. Now we're going to sterilize the rim and go ahead and close it up. Now that we are done with the active culture as epidermis, before I close it, I'm going to go ahead and sterilize the rim. And now we're going to go ahead and close it up. Okay, I'm now going to take the active culture as cerevisia. Hope I'm pronouncing that right. And we are going to go ahead and sterilize the rim here. This pipelet is done. I'm going to be placing this in bleach to sterilize that. But I'm going to now take the 1% S minus and I'm going to 
sterilize this rim. Okay. Make sure this is sterilized. Okay, now we're gonna take a clean pipe lid from the alcohol. Make sure all the excess alcohol is out. You're going to take some of the active culture into the pipe lid. Okay. Now I'm going to drop two drops of the active culture into the 1%. One, two. Okay. Gonna go ahead and sterilize this. Place our top on it. Now I'm going to grab the 7%. Make you froth. I'm gonna go ahead and sterilize the rim. Now that we have it sterilized, I'm going to go ahead and pipe it two drops into it. One, two. I'm gonna sterilize this before we close it. Now I'm going to grab the 15%. I'm gonna take that, we're gonna sterilize the rim, just like we did all of them, going in a circular motion. Now that that rim is sterilized, we are going to drop two drops of the active culture into it. One, two. Going to sterilize the rim before we close it. Okay, and I am now going to put the top on that. This pipelet will also go in um, some bleach and I'm going to sterilize this. And then we're gonna go ahead and close it up. And I'm going to now place these in my um, chosen incubation location for a total of 48 hours. Thank you.